Jersey Chef. How are y'all doing today? I'm doing good. Today we're making braised short rib, right? So we're making braised short rib. And uh, if you're Jamaican, you're wondering, you know, what the hell is short rib? Because I know a lot of Jamaicans watch this channel. All it is, is pretty much upgraded oxtail. So today we're making braised short rib and all it is is a lot of fat, a little bit of meat, bone, and you know just delicious. So this one has more meat, it has a bone right there, you know nice marbling and it has fat so it's gonna taste delicious. So braised short rib, crazy chef, Welcome to the channel, welcome to the vibe. If it's your first time here, if you like the vibe, hit that red subscribe button. But, do me a favor, just hit that like button for sport. So what you wanna do is, usually when we do our short rib, we try to season them with a dry rub. This I'm using just a garlic herb. But what you wanna do is you wanna put salt right a lot of salt so I usually make it put a lot of salt and just season Gordon Ramsay style right so a lot of salt I'm using kosher and ground pepper so first you want to salt and pepper your short rib, right? And I season right on my board, it's good for it, right? So, salt and pepper your short rib, just like that. Usually when I marinate any form of steak, I use oil, but I, in, this, in this case, I won't be using any oil. So then I take my garlic rub, and I just rub them on all sides. So take my garlic rub and I just rub them on all sides. As I said, just because of the fat on these, usually when I marinate, I use oil. This time, I won't be using any oil. And I just salt them on my board, right? And then I just kind of like, so that's the reason why I salt it on my board. It's like kind of like a, just press them in and then just kind of coat it with all that spice. So that's the reason why I salt them on the board. And after you finish that, what you want to do is you just want to leave them you know, just leave them in, leave them in your, in your refrigerator for like a good 15 to 20 minutes and just let that spice go in and then we'll cook. Crazy Chef, Big Vibe, welcome to the channel, welcome to the Vibe. All right, so we've added our oil with our meat, right? So our meat has been sitting for a while. So all we gotta do now is just place it flat in our pan. Play the shelf, big vibe. So what you wanna do is you just wanna sear on all sides. So all we're doing now is the crispy sear on our side.
add some fresh thyme. I add in some onions, some green pepper, garlic, right? Some green pepper, some garlic, a lot of tomatoes. Just because I want my tomatoes for when uh, to help with that sauce, right? So I add a lot of tomatoes and one. A lot of one. Then I just let that reduce and simmer for like two hours. So I let this reduce and simmer covered for two hours. Crazy chef, you know what I'm gonna say. Big vibe. Braised short rib, right? As I said, if you're Jamaican and you like oxtail, you'll love the braised short rib. So I'm gonna reduce this a little bit. And look how good that gravy looks, right? Just like your oxtail. That gravy looks just like your oxtail. So I'm gonna reduce this up, right? And then, we're gonna catch a vibe. That's like another 30 minutes left to reduce. Look how tender that meat gets, right? See that? See how tender that meat gets? I don't wanna break it, but you see? See that? That's good. Big vibe. So, look at that. Tell me you want some of that. Tell me you want some of that. Look at that. Look at that meat. Delicious. So we see over here. Right? So, crazy chef. Big vibe. Big, big, big vibe. But I'm more. Now we're all reduced. See that gravy nice and thick? Now we're all reduced, we're ready. I'm gonna put a vibe on it. And then I'm gonna let you know what the deal is. Mm -hmm. 